Most people in America know what their rights are and are not under American law. People who come here from foreign countries don't always think about their rights because they don't have any intention of honoring our laws. I'm sad to hear that because being a guest in our country or traveling to a foreign country is an honor for most people. The liars of America will steal anything that's not bolted down. The liars of a foreign country think that America is here for the taking, and therefore for them, theft is always around. The liars of America don't like God today. They come here with help of local organizations that want to say it's okay. I hate to tell you this, but it's not okay, and has practically destroyed America today. We cannot say that all people are the same, but if they're all coming from the same impoverished nation, then they all come with the same predilections. They all come with the same type of education. They all come with the same type of aversion to religion, and their belief is that they individually are gods today. Since I've been in Champaign, I've literally been the butt of a lot of jokes in the law enforcement network, I'm pretty sure. But what I know most importantly about these people is that they're gossips in every way. They don't honor the law if it's a law they don't feel like honoring. And that is the truth of it all. When they don't like the bad publicity, then they shouldn't give themselves bad publicity. And the truth is that people have rights to not be abused in the night. People have rights to not be sexualized and sexually oriented for their pleasure in the night. When a person is being mesmerized to sleep tight so they can't wake up, a person can be stabbed by someone. A person can be harmed by someone. A person's beard can be cut and they won't see you or hear you around them. The liars of America are playing these games. They're coming into our university and they're learning how. Why are they teaching themselves how? Why are they sharing that technology with the common man? And what's going to happen to women across the land? Not just men. In life, we have truth. The truth is, I own this computer, but someone has taken the battery from it that used to be a six-hour battery, and now I barely get a paltry two hours. Now, I am using it quite a lot. I am doing quite a lot of work. What I'm seeing is that someone has been playing on my computer. Whenever I'm in a particular place, whenever a particular boy walks onto the company site, my computer goes berserk. I'm appalled at that. Who are these people that feel they have the right to personally attack? What do they do really for a living? Why are they thinking they have the right to do this to me or anybody? The liar in America is still the liar. He will always be a liar before Christ. And even if he doesn't believe in God, if he doesn't believe in heaven, even if he doesn't believe in hell, he will end up there just as well.